Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Black Randomized. Now, it's not going to be my last for the day, by the way. As you can see, it's 18.35 up there. Um, I did not want to do another 9 o'clock session like I did at the end of Platinum. And I'm activating the wrong screen. That's OBS, not the game. <laughs> Fine. So, in the last episode, we beat Lenora and we got our second gym badge. However, someone is stealing her daddy's bone. So, we're here to find out what is exactly going on. Um, we still have the same boys, Air Force, Lancelot, and Gojira. We have these three, Cheshire, Spike, and Lullaby at the back, because, to be honest, we don't need them. Um, I'm not going to heal, so I know too full well that this is not a battle segment. That's your clue. Do you know who it is? Well, of course. It's these guys again. Now, you weird, enough fooling around. Sorry you've come, Gym Leader, but we, Team Plasma, claim this museum's Dragon Skull in the name of Pokemon Liberation. No sense. To show you we're serious, we're stealing right before your very eyes. Well then, here's our smokescreen. Plasma! Say, <laughs> like, What? <laughs> What's going on? No, oh, we have to go after them. This is totally not important at all in any way to the plot. Also, if you ever do find a fossil in the randomizer, you talk to this lady right here. Good day, Lenora. Find any good fossils lately? This is a surprise video. Are you suffering from artist block again? Hilbert, this is Burr. He may not look like it, but he's Castilia City's gym leader. Uh, just looking for a change of pace. Seems hazy or something around here. What's up? What's up? Someone just walked away with an exhibit. That's what's up. Oh, God, so many voices. Oh, hi, Hilbert. What's everyone doing here? Hilbert, is there some kind of problem? And these two are your friends? Uh, Binko and Charon. Oh, I see the trainers. Okay, then let's get up to search. I'll head this way. Everyone, Charon and Binko, we stay here at the museum. Berg and Hilbert, you two search Primal Forest. Got it? I'll count on you, everyone. Uh, you're Hilbert, is it? You're wearing a roundabout rubber. Hey. Oh, oh, Hilbert, take us with you. Can I give me the dowsing machine to give to you? Yeah, we can find hidden items. Cool. For now, we need to do is protect the museum, right? This should be easy. And tradition. Like, we could just send our Pokemon and be like, fight us. But when it's convenient, they just ignore Pokemon battles. And even sometimes they just get beaten and ignore the fact they got beaten and just go, well, I'm just going to do it anyway. What are you going to do to stop me? It's like, okay. Why did we have a Pokemon fight for then? Hey, wait for me. So, like, you could lose to, like, Giovanni. He'd be like, yeah, you might have defeated me, but I'm still not going to let you do what you want, so... Suck my ass. I beat you in a Pokemon battle. Well, it doesn't matter, because it seems to not apply to you. You just go, well, I lost. Oh, well, I'm still going to do my evil thing. And I just sit there and go, mm, okay, I guess. It's so funny when they make the decisions like that. It just makes no sense at all. Anyway, let's get on the way. Now, I did miss a few things when we came down here before. So I'm going to go and grab them real quick. In fact, we missed one, two, three hidden items. Uh, in fact. Uh, this leads to Primal Forest. If they manage to scuttle off into the forest, you might have trouble. So if we go here. There's a hidden item here. It says near the hidden... This, this is the description. I'll read it to you right now. It says, In some flowers beside a fence near Necreen City. Oh, does it mean down here? These are all flowers, right? These egg-looking things are flowers. Do you mean these flowers? Do you mean the flowers on the other side there? Either way, 
In the large puddle to the south, um, I'm going to guess you mean this puddle here. Where in this huge puddle, you may ask? I have no idea. Now, we have a dowsing machine. Let's see what it does. I've never used a dowsing machine. Usually, I just have a guide that says, go here. Register. So I press Y, right? Oh, okay. I see how it works. So it's saying there's one up here. I'm not impressed with Magus. I am not impressed. By your fucking bullshit. Um, sorry, I'm on the wrong way. Why did you just go didding? You know, I don't even want to know. Now, this one, it says, in some flowers near the challenge rock. Choice scarf? Okay. So it goes like that when we're on top of it. Okay, these seem easier to use than some of the ones in these games. Up here? Okay, Barfrey. Okay, Barfrey. Okay. I see how it is. I want to slap you into next Tuesday, but okay. Bye bye, Butterfree. I just don't like the only speech to be fair. We got an elixir, okay, cool. That isn't on my list of things that are hidden here, by the way. So let me just go over here, I wanted to just double check. Is there anything here? There is. It's gonna, yeah, here's those flowers over there. You son of a donkey. Up there? Can you get up there? You can. Okay, cool. Got nine balls. But what about those ones that was going off down here? Let me just go to. There's a couple here, isn't there? Wow. I'm not going to spend the weapons I do in this, by the way. Myers glasses? Fair enough. I mean, if I make these ones where it says hidden, I'm going, I don't know where you are, bro. There's one up here, so this is going to be the last one. I'm not going to do anymore. Oh, I remember this one. It's up here. Why don't I remember this one before? I can't bury it. Okay, that's enough of that for now. Otherwise, we'll be here all day. Um, I'll leave that on the bottom screen. Why not? It's more interesting. As we head into the Enduro, the big wolf voice. Well, you see, there are two ways out of big wolf forest. There are the go straight and the path that went through the woods. As I'm totally straight, I'll take the straight road. If they're not there, I can block the engine. And would you please take the other way and check whether the team plasma is hiding somewhere? You're basically going to the training, but it's a single place, a single path, so I'm sure you won't get lost. I mean, come on, let's do some Nora's thing. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Um. Let's go get Jira and Lancelot. Let's do this double battle! Also, I like how we're basically here to stop this evil team and we still go, oh no, we locked eyes and the rules say we must take on a battle. A Swanner and Venusaur. Did I set this thing to like, <laughs> set fully evolved at level one or something? This is what it feels like. I'm getting slapped. The slapping me with a thick, meaty cock, bro. All right. Now... I want to take out this one first. This one's going to go as fast as the A1. Let me guess, you're going to get a 20% chance of doing a confusion on me? I 
I don't even need to speak. I don't even need to speak about the nonsense that this game is doing to me right now. 20% chance of paralysis on Thundershot. Got it twice, back to back. 20% chance of um, confusion on the water poles. Got it first time. 10% chance of poison off a poison sting. Got it first time. This this is getting off to an amazing start, bro. Actually, I'm just going to bite you to be fair. Little nibble on your mind, little nibble. Or nibble on your sausage. <laughs> At least I snapped out of confusion, that's nice. Although... Two things. Still two things. <laughs> first things first. We got a healer just out here. So ain't the end of the world. Excuse me lady, can I have a free healies please? The Venus oil just tore me in two. Oh god. Second thing, second. We get a new encounter here, but before we get a new encounter, we have to deal with this pinhead. You stubborn brat, when I threw with you, you won't be able to chase us anymore. Plasma. Is that, what is it? What's the Z for? PZ. Plasma? It's an S. Oh, me bloody shell, me, my, me bloody shell, me, it's falling in the easy car. Oh, no. So you would think that Shelmet evolves into a Scavalier, in which case you'll be wrong. Shelmet does not evolve into a Scavalier, in fun fact. <laughs> Carablast evolves into a Scavalier in a weird swap. So if you see Carablast later, you would see why it's a weird swap. But basically, you have to trade in a Scavalier. Scavalier. You have to trade a Shelmet for a Carab uh, Carablast. And when you do that, you see they evolve. But what happens is Carablast takes a Scavalier's Shelmet's metal and becomes a Scavalier. And Shelmet takes Carablast's like something that's not really clear and wraps itself up like a mummy and becomes a Selgor. It's really weird. Carablast just looks like a normal beetle. My little beetle boy. So anyway, let's get our encounter first before we do anything else. Let's get dusty. I'm back in that position though, where I feel like I'm going to kill this thing with whatever I do, even though I'm probably not. So let's bite it. You live? You live? Then mayhaps we can find you a position, my brother. You lived. Mayhaps we can find you a position. Although it is dependent on your agreeability to staying in the ball. Nebby don't want to stay in the bag. I sorts don't want to stay in the ball. You don't want to stay in the ball, that's fine. Tick tock, bro, tick tock, bro. The clock is ticking. That SpongeBob nose, as long as that SpongeBob nose is up on that screen there, that stands on is going. As long as that stands on is going, you lose an HP every time, bro. You can come with us and see a world of imagination, or you can say whatever you want. Um, you know, get turned into mayonnaise. You're a dust tox. You need to know your place. And your place is kind of low down the food chain. You made the good choice. You made the good choice, bro. Poison morph Pokemon. Toxic powder is scattered with each flap. At night, it is known to strip leaves off of trees lining boulevards. What? I'm how annoying these things are. Can you imagine how annoying these things are? Like, bro. Bro. Imagine moths the size of dogs. Bro. Anyway. Let's get some items choice band because this game wants me to die apparently also we can put this thing on again I wish I had repels that would have been terrible I mean I say that 
by the fact that I really, 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 really like Articuno. Like, really, really like Articuno. But, you know, it's gotta be said, bro. You know I ain't catching it. You saw Lyron. Lyron didn't want to go in the bag. The moth didn't want to go in the bag. These things are having like their catch rates tripled, quadrupled. So they'd be so small that they don't want to do anything. So you imagine me trying to catch a legend. Oh, it's not here. All right. Wow. You know what? Wouldn't have mind the side up. Wouldn't have mind the side up. You know why? We already have a bug tap. The name of the game is called Diversity. How did I... How am I slower than a side up? What do you... Excuse me? I know I'm not super fast, but damn, bro. All right, you need to fight me right now. Also, you see that up there? That's the Mossy Rock to get Leafy on. See, they did, they did think. They thought about it, like... What happens if we give you an Eevee? We still need to make you have all the mechanics to get Eevee. It's one of the funny things about the newer ones, because, like... They made it so that Magnezone and Nose Pass only evolve in a certain area. So they've had to constantly make like a magnetic area in every game since. So they've had to add a Mossy Stone and Ice Stone. Because how else are you supposed to do your, do your bits, innit? How else are you supposed to do them things? Hell yeah, you're going down, bro. Sorry, I'm empty handed. Do I look like the kind of girl to carry a heavy load? Mm. <laughs> yes, you do. You look like you take all kinds of loads. Mm. Now, I believe the item in question is down here, right? Yep. Fighting gem. Nice. Right, the batons are away, so now we have... What level are we? 20, actually, we're 21 anyway, and everyone's 22. That's a Carablast, there you go. That thing there, Carablast? I think they're trying to say it takes off his chitin, his little shell, his chitin shell, whatever it's how you pronounce it. Like, I guess the idea is they're both wearing kind of like an outfit. Like, he's wearing the blue and yellow bit, and he's like the black bug inside. So he takes that off and gives it to Shelmet, and then Shelmet takes off the metal part and gives it to him. Because if you look, I can one-shot you. Let me go. Because if you look at his face there. Why am I going to items? Why am I going to items? And then you look at his face. And that's kind of small. But you see he's got he's got yellow and blue on his tummy there. And he's got the black face with the yellow eyes. The red irises. He's just wearing Shelmet's parts. And I don't know what Shaman gets out of it because he's rubs and run. He's got like he's covered in like mummy bandages. I don't know where he gets them from because Car Carabas ain't wearing them. That's how Gore is. <laughs> hey, it's Rosie. Wouldn't mind the grass type right now. Water and grass. I'm looking for water, grass, and fire right now. Electric, electric. Water is number one. Electric and fire come second. Grass fourth. Ground type wouldn't be bad either. Man, oh man, this AI loves status stuff, bro. This AI loves statuses. By the way, these are going to give us all berries. That's what the point of the power ranges of Doom is to give us berries. Can I just get this out again? Cool. Hey, brother, find me. Oh man, I just swapped the bird. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, we clap in them cheeks. I'm doom? Wouldn't mind. Actually, no, I would mind that boy because he's a dark type. Unfortunately, he's a dark type as well. Unnerved, we can't eat our berries. Oh no. no. Alright, we're going to rock slide you. Did you just smog us? Okay. Okay. Right, Houndoom. That's no use to you. Goodbye. 
What else you got? Wigglytuff? Air Force, you need to take this thing down. If it's going to hit Sing, even though it's 50% accurate, it's going to land it on you, and you're going to fall asleep, and then it's just going to defense coal and growl and double slap you because it's a piece of shit. Should have gone for double team, to be fair. You an asshole. That might save us, though. If we get a crit, he's dead. We didn't get a crit, but... But, he's dead now. Oh, he gets a crit, though. Got four or five as well. Now, if you did that, which I suspect you would, guess who's got a quick attack? Me. I got a quick attack. You ain't living that. <laughs> Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Guess what? You see that pile of grass up there? Yep, it's a ranger. This is what they do. They hide when they pop out to fight you and make you get really angry because you're like, bro. Oh, hello, Metagross. Hello, Metagross. How do you do? I hope you are well. I hope that you don't Metal Claw me into existence. Out of existence, I should say. Ah, very nice. You are whoa going to do that, and you get a crit on your first turn because this game hates my life. Okay. You guys have done that to me, like, multiple times. First turn, crit. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Thanks again, a critical hit with a super effective move from a further save of legendary. A super, super, super effective. I really appreciate you doing that. Oh, and you got the attack boost on the second one. How nice. Very nice. Very, very nice. Very nice. Are oh, you going to magnet rise? You can't get hurt by uh, ground types. Very good, because I'm not ground type. That's fine. Turn Eagle, though. My god, what a POS. Piece of shit. You get a crit on the first one, almost take out my best guy, and you get an attack boost on the second one. You can't make the shot. I don't even want your berry, bro. I don't even want your berry. Keep it. You. Why are these odds? What are these odds, bro? If I had these odds, I would never lose. She's on these fresh waters. Take a sip, bro. Also, let's get rid of this rage candy bar because it's been bothering me sitting down there. You look like the kind of beast that wants rage candy, you know what I'm saying? I didn't mean to press that. Uh, you could use a potion. I didn't mean to do that, but you could use a potion as well. Thank you. It's over there. All right. All right, first of all, while I'm playing silly games, go Jitter Fire Force, please. I think this is going to be another, yep. See, later on in the game, it becomes less of the problem because I'll be like, oh, there's a Metagross. Let me bring my Fire type in. No problem. Mm, good thing I brought my Fire type out, bro, isn't it? <laughs> good thing. Alright, let's take care of this little boy. There's way too much living going on in this game, you know that. There's way too much slithering, there's way too much critting, there's way too much small chant odds happening against me. This game seems cursed. This game feels cursed. I mean, the bad luck is going against us constantly. Right, it's saying straight down, turn, down, turn. It's in here, right? Hell yeah, it is. Are you another Power Ranger? No, you're not. Cool. But we got one of you ginger boys. Bam, 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 bam. We are not going to beat this in 30 minutes. I don't think we are. I think we're about halfway. Shaman, the legendary hedgehog. 
They should have made its alternate form be more like Sonic. It would have been kind of fun if they just made it give it like Sonic the Hedgehog proportion. Right, it's a legend, so there's no way this is going to live on the sliver. This is going to take like 50, right? All right, a bit more than I thought. He growing. Oh boy, he growing. Don't matter though. Sorry, Shaman. It's a shame. Ooh, that was a nice XP though. Yeah, I'm here to buy time. I know. Just jump out, bro, it's fine. It's fine, just jump out. I know one of you are one of you are one of these bros. Oh look, there you are. <laughs> Fool! I wish I could press the speed up button. It would be so cool to see. If I could go at 100 miles an hour, I just want to lose this speed. Right, so in spirit. What what backdoor nonsense are you gonna do to me? All right, nothing. So you're outsped and critical hit. Get out of it. Thank you, bro. Now this bit can be a slog, especially if you get really bad luck with what they have. They have strongness. They have strongness on their teams. Oh, Shapito. Can I run from a Sharpedo? I'm fast, but he's exceptionally fast. I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to quick attack him. And then see what that does. Okay. Critical hit. Just quick attack. Just a one shot him. Not expecting it to do that. Um, I'll take the win. Don't want well win. Sorry. Um, i shot by that, actually. Not going to lie. Not going to lie, brother. Fiery dance. Ooh. This is all good stuff for later. Um... We can actually get something that can use these moves. All right. Oh, can you? Mm, a pursuer. <laughs> a kid like you beat some of us. No, can't be helped. But I'll take you on now. This is the end, I think, isn't it? I've never been in an open area. We might make it on time. Oh my god, I'm shocked. I'm shook. I'm shocked. Right, Dun's Fast. Dun's Fast can be a problem. Problem. I want to focus on Air Force a little bit. Now, this is probably going to glare me, right? So I'm going to go for Double Team. I love Double Team. The reason I love Double Team, it applies to me. It raises my evasion. What did it just do? I didn't even read. What did it just do? But it raises my evasion. So if he swaps out, or if I knock him out and he brings out another Pokemon, I still have that evasion. Doesn't matter, you're on me, bro. I'm setting up. Um, whereas if I use Smoke Screen, for example, and the Pokemon faints or they swap out, we're back to where we started. So I'd have to start putting Smoke Screens on the next Pokemon, right? This don't work like that. Oh. Alright, he's defense curling, which can be a problem because he's kind of thick. Like. That's not what our goal is. Rage. Also, he landed in rage at plus three. Plus three evasion, he landed in rage. A bit sus, bro. Right, plus four. Still doing under the rage at plus four. Getting even more sus. Plus five. Right, plus four, you should not be hitting me at all. You should be barely hitting me. Hmm, cool. That's the one that actually matters. I don't want him to glare me. So he's got defense core, rage, glare, leer. Oh, not leer. Um, yawn. Alright. Slash. Slash him. What? Oh, yeah, because he's got rage. Are you landing a yawn? You have 33% accuracy. How are you yawning me, bro? That's what you get, bro. Reuniclus. I'll stay in. 
There's the big boy. Critical hit, done. They're level 14, so... Watch out. Watch out could be a pure pain in the anus. This thing... Right, well, that's you. This thing can give you issues, bro. If you're playing vanilla as well. This thing is super fast, and it has, like, hypnosis and all these other nonsenses that it can just do to you. And it's just such a pain. It will just cause you ball ache. Uh, sand attack. You trying with sand attack. It does all that kind of nonsense. It does all kind of like, like messing with you nonsense. And then when it gets a high level, it gets Hyper Fang that does like 50% of your HP guaranteed. Every time you get Hyper Fang, you drop to 50. Then it will start Super Fanging you and hitting you super hard. And it's like, what? Fine, take your stupid skull. It's a Dragonite, bro. So the dream our king had, the dream we had, won't come true. Gorm, how are you holding up, fellow subject to our king? Gorm of the Seven Sages, I am mortified that this skull which we went to so much trouble to obtain was stolen from us so easily. It is not important. We can afford to abandon the dragon skull. According to the results of our research, this is not the legendary Pokemon. For which team Plasma is looking. It is completely unrelated. But we will not allow anyone to disrupt our plans and get away with it. We will fix it so you'll never interfere with us again. Just pulls out a Glock. Boom. Oh, sweet. The bug Pokemon were getting all worked up, so I came. I want to inspire with my little eye, an important looking guy. Are you here to have your friends while defeated? Yellow bird. Bug. The others didn't have anything, and who are you supposed to be? Is this the big boss? I am one of the seven sages of Team Plasma. Gets us. The other of the seven sages will never read Pokemon with words alone. I've already done his voice wrong. Harry Potter. <laughs> the remainder of the seven sages have ordered their compatriots. We take Pokemon with full force, but the odds are a little against us now. To you, the bug Pokemon use a bug, and the normal Pokemon use a bug, I say. Know your enemies, know yourselves, and do not need to fear the result of a hundred battles. This time we shall retreat quietly. To secure the liberation of Pokemon, we will steal Pokemon from trainers. Even though you are gym leaders, we will not tolerate any further obstruction from you. In any case, we will see you someday. I hope you are looking forward to that time as much as I. Man just pulls out the nine million, sprays them down. They're a speedy bunch. What are you planning to do, Berg? Are you going to chase them? Mm. We got back the stolen skull, but if we corner them, there's no telling what they might do. I think it's best to head back to Lenora. Well, now. Well, I'll be waiting to challenge you at Caselius' Pokemon gym. Mm, yes, indeed. I'm looking certainly forward to it. Cool. Hilbert, you're holding the dragon skull. You work so hard to get back, right? Okay. Hilbert, thank you so much. Hilbert, Hilbert, <laughs> Hilbert. What kind of trainer are you taking care of them? You must be happy. What do you think is going to my trap Rabbit, Oh, Moonstone. Yep, it's a Moonstone. You can evolve things. Why do they give you a Moonstone? Because they expected you to catch a Muna. A Muna evolves of a Moonstone to Mushana. Although, if you did do what I said and you run into little jiggly jiggly stone, uh, stones, you can read nobles at the same time, you run into jiggly jiggly bush, you could have caught Mishana as is, but he won't know anything because it's a stony bush, so yeah, I spit much it. We are not done, even though we're at 34 minutes. Um, oh yeah, we can't go here yet because guys like, ah, you're not the champion. Go away, you're not the champion yet. I hate you. Ah, oh, you son of a donkey. You went to heal. But yeah, these trainers, we have to fight them first. I'm sorry. That would have been a good ending point, but... I'm just going to try and get back to the heal point without having to fight any of them. So we can start the next episode fighting them and making our way to New York. But you have angered me. And as such, I will stride you down. Sorry. 
Mill tank. You know what? Mill tank last time gave us the clappage of a lifetime. It clapped our cheeks hard. We're taking like so much damage off of the scavenger, but madness. What level is this mill tank? 15. Alright. We got increased defenses. And SpongeBob's nose is up. It's gonna outspeed us still, right? Ha ha, you dumbass. You went for milk drink even though you went first. Can't heal with the damage you haven't taken yet. Right, it's gonna milk drink again, right? Normally, I don't care, but you're literally just doing this to make the thing go on for longer. Alright, went for Stomp, finally. Doesn't matter if you clinch me because you had one HP. You were going down to the sandstorm anyway, bro. But thank you for your contribution. Uh, no, I do not want to learn Scary Face. Why does it take a while to think? That's like really weird. Like there, it's like taking a while. Timber, hell yeah, I'm swapping out for a Timber. I'm not fighting Timber. Uh, I want to get Lance got some levels, but I don't think a Timber is the best thing to fight because it's not really going to give a lot of XP. So this is matchup for this game. And those red things on his sort of knees, the back of his head and his armpits are veins. He has big, thick, pulsating veins on him like he was a wiener. It is kind of disgusting. I don't want to think about it too much, but that is the explanation for those things. You're a trainer. We're going to fight all of you. Come on, why not? Let's make this 45 minutes. Who gives a shit? We want on. I should have just talk to the normal man. You know what? That's it. End of the episode. Done. Nah, man. We're going to clap all these boys. Hey, it's Baby Stolly. Who is your daddy and what does he do? Unfortunately for you. Gonna quick attack? No, he's not going to quick attack. I was sure he was going to quick attack me right there. Oh well. How about me? So here we were. I was trying to get here. So I could just go, excuse me, can you help me please? Thank you very much, I appreciate it. I think there's only like three more trainers on this route, so we're just going to clap them. There's no, whoops. There's no wilds here, so we won't be getting a wild encounter for a little while. So we fought you, going to fight. You don't fight, you've already walked into us. You're not one of those weird ones who are like, I already fought if you talk to me. Like her. Um, well, oh, the e caller. Look at him, he's a happy little boy. Even though his moveset is absolute garbage. Although I think this is the game they finally give him energy ball. You just want to make this go on for longer, don't you? Just that. Just attack me, bro. I don't care. Give me damage. Why are you making it take longer? Oh, my God. Try us up. Cool. What status effect are you going to give me? Oh, the move that's supposed to give you higher chance of doing status effect you don't do. Okay, cool. Crudon? Nope. Same. I might have lowered attack, but, you know, twin... And raise his defense. See, they're just making it longer. They're deliberately drawing this shit out. It's so annoying. Oh, turn one. Let me lower your def Let me lower your attack so you do less damage. So it makes it longer. Oh, well, let me raise my defense. Oh, now you're gonna go for an attack. You just done that turn one. You're not gonna kill me either. But no, you make it so he definitely has to go two turns on both of your asses. Plus three attack, look at that. Yeah. yeah. I think this guy's a fight as well, right? No, nope, you're not. Okay, cool, we're done. So we're just going to make our way. Where have I seen this scene before? Hmm. Reminds me of a title card. I don't know why. <laughs> so I think you talk to some of these people that they give you stuff like, yeah, hey, dude, have a quick claw. Um, but we're going to go here onto Sky Arrow Bridge. So, get to take this in as we do the long run. And yes, look underneath, there is actually vehicles. There is actually cars in the Pokemon world. There's actually roads. 
even though there has been sort of trucks and stuff in the games before, like when we move in at the beginning of Gen 3 and Gen 1, the mystery truck that we knew is supposed to be under. Even though that's a thing, they never have shown roads or anything. Look, there's even a ship underneath us, even though we've seen ships before. There's ships and cars. Even though it's the same transport truck. It just generally has appeared to me in the Pokemon world that everyone travels by foot or bicycle. Maybe flying on a Pokemon, but here we go. It's Castelia City, New York of Pokemon world. So we go down the 45 degrees. Imagine having to go from a town to a city by bridge by foot. My god, it took you hours. So anyway, look, the Queen City. Sunny, Castelia City. Sunny. Ooh. <laughs> So here we are, we've made it to New York, Castelia City. Let's go over to the Pokemon Center because there's quite a lot to do here. And there's not only just Berg's Gym, there's story stuff to do here as well. There's an encounter, there's tons of hidden items. This lady asks us if we know about the Geonet and we say yes. You see that big spinning earth up in the top corner? Well, there to you guys. Um, up these stairs, this big spinning earth. You can tell them where you live. Because this game loves you to share your personal data. Let's just drop off some boys in the PC so you'll know if you've watched this far for the next episode what is going on. So he's not got an item. So I'm going to drop Leron in here. And I'm going to drop Jubilee. But I'm going to swap Jubilee for Dustox. Just because I want to keep one, one smack around boy. So yes, next time we are going to go to the gym, we're going to deal with some more Team Plasma shenanigans, and we're going to get a new encounter, because we're going to go to a route early. Um, there's the route north of here, the desert route, um, we normally get Sand Isle. Wait, Sand Isle Moxie. Hmm. So good. Ground types in this game are amazing. That cave where we where we fought the two uh, dudes with the High Dragon and the Carnivine, you can get yourself, um, what's the baby extra drill called? Jilba. You get a Jilba from there, you and you get a um, Sand Dial from north of here with Moxie. Game. Game. <laughs> they utterly wreck everything. But for now, we're going to stop the installment, So, and I'm going to stop the session, because I had to go eat, because I'm starving. Um, but thanks for watching. Um, see you next time on another episode of Pokemon Black Randomized Nesbuck. But for now, goodbye.